Hello everybody and welcome to this tutorial on building an AFK uh, zombie pig farm. So it took uh, 15 minutes of just uh, sitting there to collect all those zombie pigmen and uh, now flick a switch and get them to kill themselves. So let's uh, show you how it's built. So I've dug a bit out here already just to save some time. Uh, you'll want to place cobblestone or any other block that can withstand uh, gas attacks. Um, so ordinary stone will do or um, obsidian if you uh, want to build the whole thing out of that. Uh, this is just, uh, I'm just using cobblestone because it's an easy block to uh, get lots of hold of. Uh, incidentally, there's a cobblestone generator uh tutorial I've made as well and I'll uh, put in a link for that in the description if you want to know how to get it. So here we go just build a ladder here. Now I've already dug down here but you'll want to dig down at least 25 blocks. I've done a bit more here so keep an eye on the y coordinate so we're from 47 to 21, 726 there and uh, next we're going to put a chest and buy our way out here like so and then two hoppers to ensure that it uh, collects all the uh, uh, all the gold because some of it will drop onto the other block and you'll want that to be collected as well so shift right click and then shift jump right click for the second one just put some bread in and check it works yep so let's uh, go back up do uh, the rest of it and I'll show you it in operation so here we are now the important bits you want a trap door a uh, wooden one will do but uh, iron ones can survive gas blasts and then for the door you want to place it like that so it's open um, as default and then we close it so that represents an open door to zombie pigmen and uh, that's the trick to this design so let's just build a roof there we go like so get rid of that block so there. Uh, if you want to get on the roof Put a, it's advisable to put a trapdoor as well, but uh, I'm not going to bother for this. So, I've updated my game mode. Now let's get some zombie pigmen angry. There we go. So they're running at us. They'll run at us for all directions, and they'll try and get through the door to try and get to us. Because they think it's open, but it's not. So if we just wait for this one here. Alright, let's go down. And if we flick this switch here, this opens the trapdoor and they will eventually all push themselves through like that. Now uh, I'm just going to skip a bit here so uh, uh, those two get stuck. If they get stuck just go on the roof and give them a quick hit that uh, can solve it but eventually they'll work their way through anyway. But here as you can see collect some XP and we've got a gold in, got a couple of gold nuggets so that that presumably be the main reason you'd want this either XP or, uh, or gold so let's go up. Now what you can do is just stay in this box and wait and you'll get like maybe a certain number of nuggets per hour, not a whole lot. But uh, if I uh, go into creative again I will show you um, a modification you can make to this to make it lots more efficient. So here we have exactly the same thing but on top of it I have got uh, a tube. It's uh, 20 spanning from the middle block, so 41 in total uh, long. Uh, yeah, so exactly the same here. Oh, another tip maybe add some carpet on the blocks that you're not standing on so that zombie pigmen can't spawn in there. And as you can see, inside what we have here is a railway. Now, so we basically go up and down this railway, collecting zombie pigmen from each end of it. So this one's handy if you've got a if you've got a valley like I've found here, but you can make the railway go in lots of directions depending on what you want. So I'll uh, just find a zombie pigment and update my game mode. So let's have a quick look for one here. Um, oh, there seems to be any around. Oh, come on, yeah, let's go for this one. Oh, what a shot. Uh, yeah, so he's running at us now. So if we run back here and inside, there we go, and Nothing there. Hop in our minecart and flick the switch. Now it's only ever one powered uh, rail here to keep you moving quite slowly because the slower you move the better it works. But let's uh, skip ahead and uh, I 
can show you what it looks like after about 15 minutes of uh, going back and forth. So here we go. So this is after, like I say, 15 minutes of being stood here. Aha, uh -huh. you can't get me. And uh, if we go down here, flick the switch to open up the trap door, and they're all falling down. Now, it'll take them a while for them to all fall down, so I'll skip ahead again. Here we go. So they've all fallen down now. Let's see what we've got. So, while we're going down here to collect all our XP and gold, uh, just take a second to say thank you for watching. Uh, oh, just a little note. You don't always get all the XP. I'm not quite sure as to the reason for that, but uh, most of the time you do. So, now it's all been collected. Let's have a look at the gold. We've got 58 nuggets and 3 ingots. You'll get at best about 50 ingots an hour from this design. Uh, so, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. Bye.